Welcome to the Ganarelix injection video. We're going to be showing how to administer your pre-filled syringe of Ganarelix. Please confirm with your care team that this is the evening that you should be starting this medication. This is typically something that's started towards the middle to end of your treatment cycle and they will give you an exact night to start this. Typically it's taken every evening around the same time of night once it's started because this is going to prevent you from ovulating. So it's very important to keep a consistent level of this medicine uh, at all times. Inside of this box is a pre-filled syringe of medicine and it's a standard dose, nothing you have to dial up or mix, it's just a pre-filled needle. The most that you might need to do here is remove an air bubble. So I'm going to be flicking that air bubble so that it rises to the top of the syringe. I can uncap my needle here and I'm just going to be pushing out the air. So we're just basically pushing up on this plunger a little bit to make that bubble very small. I don't need to see medicine squirting out of the top of this needle, but removing it as much as possible. That's your prep. What we're going to be doing is just very carefully putting this into the cap and putting it off to the side and prepping our injection site. We're going to be going into that same abdominal site, so U-shaped area of skin around the belly button, making sure our hands are clean and washed. Alcohol swab will just clean the skin to prepare the area. And this is the same type of injection that you've likely been doing prior. So that area of clean skin, we're gonna uncap our needle, pinch that skin, holding this like a pen or a dart, between 45 to 90 degrees angle. One, two, three, that whole needle tip goes in. We push the plunger all the way down, so just administering the full amount taking this out. If you have a piece of gauze, you can hold it over with some pressure. And then this is now empty and it goes directly into your red sharps container.